guess it won't be long till the stores run dry. Or cheer up. There'll always be people to steal. Ah, my friend. Rice likes you, I can tell. Yeah, how? Because you are still among the living. The task at hand is as easy as can be. You simply have to make a few pickups from some nearby settlements. Which ones? The first is Jafar's wheel station. It's just east of here. But bear in mind, not everyone you talk to today will be in a cooperative state of mind. I'm sure you can be convincing, though, no? You're here to join? <laughs> Shit, you wouldn't last a minute. I can't say I'm surprised that Rise went back on his word. But the GRE won't let me just walk away. Plus, if there's any chance that we can get that Antis in, I have to try. So this time he wants me to gather protection money from the surrounding settlements. And after this, he better hand over the drugs. Crane here. Report. Another job for Rice. This one's pretty dirty. He's forcing me to collect the money he's extorting from a nearby village. Just do what he asks and stay close to him. Remember what's at stake. Yeah, Crane out. by the wheel station. Talk you long enough. Get the job done and make it fast. This is just the first stop. You Jafar? Oh, I understand all. My name isn't important. What's important is that Rise sent me and that you owe him some money. I've never seen you before. For all I know, you're just some random asshole. Fuck off. I'll tell you what. How about I break both your legs and drag you through the streets back to Rice's place, huh? And then he can explain to you that you should have cooperated. Okay, okay. Jesus. You are one of Rise's thugs. You guys are the only ones who would act this shitty. Here, here's your money. Take it. And if I have to come back here... You won't get any more attitude. Mi casa su casa. Just don't hurt me, all right? Kareem, it's me. So I just threatened to break an old man's legs. And it worked, didn't it? Next, you collect a tribute from the fisherman's village. Head east, to the tunnel entrance. Their messenger always meets us there. Crane, how you doing, mate? I'm... running errands for Rise. He wields a lot of power, scares a lot of people. Damn right he does. That's a mate, time's getting short. Almost out of As much as I hate to admit it, I'm getting worried. I'm doing the best I can out here, Brecken. I know, I know. I understand. I just want you to be aware of the stakes. I'm infected too, remember? Believe me, I'm motivated. All right, all right. Here's hoping you can make it back to the tower soon. Ah! <laughs> 
Hey, Kareem, I just saw something I've never seen before. This huge bloated infected just fucking exploded. Yeah, we call them bombers. Some of our guys use them to kill other infected. Shoot them, and they take out everything in a three meter radius. You kidding me? Keep your distance and you'll be fine. But what about the courier? Was he there? No, I didn't I didn't see anybody, just fucking zombies. Alright. You'll have to go to the village directly, I suppose. Look for a man named Gersel. Okay, hey, Kareem, I'm outside the village, but there's a whole horde of infected in there. So, clear them out. We get paid for protection. Do some protecting. I gotta get that gate closed before more of those fuckers get inside.
Hello? Anyone here? Just stay still. Maybe he'll go away. Anyone here? Rice sent me. I'm here for a pickup. Yes? Who, who goes there? I'm here on Rice's behalf. I'm supposed to pick something up. Oh my god. That's one of Rice's men. What do I do? Just tell him to go away. Do it nice and maybe he'll leave us alone. Better yet, send it to Gersel. He'll know what to do. Please, we don't know anything. Go, talk to Gersel. He lives about the store. Hey, anybody in there? Shh, not so loud. You'll draw the monsters. Look, I got rid of them, but you better reinforce that gate before more show up. You got rid of them? All of them? Rye sent me. You, Gersel? Oh, you were for Rye's. Uh, I should have known this was too good to be true. You've taken enough. You can't have any more frickin' tell him. Ayla, please. Just let me talk to the man. You can't just push us around like this frickin' gonna kick your ass. Do it, frickin'. Kick his ass. For God's sake. Look, I don't want any trouble, but we already paid this month. You're going to bleed us dry. That is entirely not my problem. Rise wants his payment, so you make the payment or things get bad for you and your woman. You can't threaten us. Kick his ass, Firkin. Give me a break, Isla. All right, fine, here. This is all of it. Ugh, a real man would have kicked his ass. Yeah, I'll leave you to it. Sounds like you have bigger problems than money. Okay, Kareem, I got Gersel's money. I fucking hate myself now, but I got the money. The self-hatred fades eventually. Just one pick up the gold at the ferry station on the old pier. There's a ferry. Farewell until the Navy sent it to the bottom of the bay. Dozens of people were stranded there, waiting for another one that never came. Are there any boats left? Yes, but any boat that tries to leave the bay gets blown right out of the water. I'm here to make a pickup for Rise. Back already? We just paid off you blood suckers. <sighs> Don't shoot the messenger. I'm just trying to get by like everybody else. Yeah? So are we. Rise said he'd protect us if we paid him. But so far, all he's done is take our money. There's no protection, just threats. You any different? Look, all I want to do is get this over with. What's it gonna take, huh? Don't need to point out how easy it would be to set this entire place on fire. Jesus Christ. You people are fucking monsters. All my money's in that satchel. Take it and get the fuck out. Hey, for what it's worth, this isn't something I want to do. I'd rather be helping you guys. And yet you're still doing it, aren't you? Okay, Kareem. I made the collection at the ferry station. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to hell. Join the club. Now, come back and claim your prize. Good job today. Hey, what are you looking for? Something I can use for a terror kit. The rise takes over this place. We're going to need plenty of them. That's something they do, see? Amputations. Rise.
always gets a kick out of it. Wondering how I know? That motherfucker kept me locked in a cage for three weeks. I saw plenty. Sometimes it was like he was experimenting. See what would do the job best, you know? Machete, axe, shotgun, hell. He took this one guy's leg off at the knee and had to hear time how long it took the poor bastard to bleed out. It's a valid strategy. To kill an enemy? Well, that is one down. But you hurt an enemy. Then you've got the wounded guy out of the fight. Plus, it'll take at least two more people to take care of him. Three for the price of one. <laughs> There's value in sadism, I guess. Given the right circumstances. Wow, bet you're a lot of fun at parties. What's wrong? Someone's turned on the 18th floor. We're doing our best to contain the situation, but... We can't sugarcoat this crane. We need Anderson right fucking now! Rise has promised me two crates, Brecken. Two crates. I'm doing this shit as fast as I can, I swear. Way back, I guess. Good. I need you to make a quick detour. Uh, why? One of our patrols went off the grid somewhere near the market. How is that my problem? I'm making it your problem. See if you can find them, or don't bother coming back. Kareem, I think I found your lost patrol. Yeah, something ripped him limb from limb. Search the bodies. Look for some blueprints in a small envelope. And don't damage them. They're worth more than all those dead assholes put together. Holy shit! You asked for it! Holy shit! I 
that yet. Wait a sec. Okay, got it. Good. Bring it back to me right away. You're going to be a hero around here. Hey, you! Come over here! I'm on the antenna, do you see me? I'm up here! I need your help! Safe to say that Rice isn't the most popular person in town, huh? No, but he is the most feared. And you know the old saying, it is better to be feared than loved if one cannot be both. Ah, uh, Machiavelli. Correct. Smart fellow, that one. Right, here are the blueprints. Excellent. You're a lot more dependable than most of these drunks. Rise is waiting for you. Maybe we can work together again sometime. God, I hope not.
If you show them compassion, they will see it as weakness. Give them a hand, and they will take your whole arm. Understand? I give you shelter, I give you bread, women, bullets, and you cannot make a simple task. I should send every one of you to the pit. Ah, the Tower Lackey returns. Do you have something for me, friend? Yes, I do. Now it's time for you to give me what you promised. Two crates of Andesin. I think not. Your loyalty to the Tower is nothing but blind obedience, Crane. A coward's submission to false hierarchies. You follow their rules as thoughtlessly as you follow mine. Like a good little dog. Look, we had a deal. Your people need the Antazine. Now, more than ever, I would surmise. But a man who follows someone else's rules is no man at all. Here, I will allow you this much. You promised me two crates of it. This is only five vials. If you want more, I present you with an opportunity. The athlete, the Scorpion, Jade Aldemir. She's one of your number. Bring her to me. I have an arena where men fight for our amusement. I would have this Scorpion fight for us. I'm curious how long it will take for someone of her caliber to uh, break. What? No. No, forget it. I'm not doing it. I hear no true conviction in your voice, Crane. You have not yet made your choice, I can tell. Will you be a dog and save the dwellers of the tower? Or will you be a man and save the maiden? Go and think about it.